Hey, what's up? It's Bentley and welcome back to my channel. So I'm starting the series of the mind fucks of being trans and transitioning later in life. I started transitioning when I was 26. I'm now 27. So like I had a whole life before transitioning. So every episode I do of this is just going to be a different topic, I guess. So these are going to be pretty triggering, I think. It could get kind of dark. I don't know. I'm not going to like plan any of this shit. I just like being open and honest and like talking about whatever comes to my mind. But this first episode is about dealing with family, uh, all sorts of family stuff uh, while transitioning and how weird it can be. So let's get right into it. Yay. So first off with my parents, that took them a while to like kind of get the pronouns and stuff right. Uh, understandably so because I was 26 when I transitioned, but it shouldn't have been a shock like it was to them because I always acted like a dude and like always did like stereotypical dude stuff. Not saying that you need to do that to be trans and be valid and stuff, but just like they were really shocked about it, which was kind of weird to me because it was pretty obvious. Uh, they still sometimes will like accidentally misgender me or I notice they'll kind of say Bentley and say my name instead of using pronouns at all. So like it'll be funny because like we'll be having like conversations and instead of saying like oh he did this they'll just say Bentley did this and I don't know if it's because they're uncomfortable or what but I don't want to bring that up or talk about it because I'm awkward and would rather just not deal with the confrontation but that's just something I've noticed that's a little weird. My little brother is 17 he's cool about it I don't know his thoughts on it or if he cares at all because he's 17 and like he likes video games and stuff but yeah as far as my parents go I've noticed it took him a long time compared to some other people and it was just it's always kind of awkward and I don't really know I don't talk about it that much so it's just like a weird thing but that was a uh, that's like whatever a lot of my cousins and stuff I just totally like deleted on Facebook when I came out because they were like big Trump supporters and everything and I just don't even want to like go down that road or like explain anything and they weren't like important in my life anyways and I really like having positive like supportive people around not like Trump supporter people so that was a whole nother thing the main like mind fuck out of this whole thing is my one grandma that is still alive uh, has dementia or Alzheimer's or something I don't know if she's been diagnosed but she's like losing her ability to think and stuff like that on her own so she'll call me sometimes or text me and she still uses my dead name and then I'll be in the middle of a conversation with her and she is like I'm really confused who this is and I think part of that is because my voice is dropped so she'll call me and she probably has uh, my dead name in her phone still because she I don't know if she even knows what like being trans is she's on my Facebook page but also she her mind's not working so I don't know what she knows or sees or whatever but basically she will call and then be like I'm so confused who this is and unfortunately I just dead name myself because I don't know how to even explain to her that I'm transitioning and stuff and I don't want her more confused than she already is and I as much as that sucks for me to misgender and like dead name myself to my grandma every time when she's confused I think it's just better for me at least to bite the bullet and not have her be even more confused because she's already confused about everything that's going on and she's confused about when she talks to her daughter and like my uncle and cousins and all that stuff so for me I would just like make her life a little easier and just deal with it even though it really sucks as far as my aunts and uncles and stuff go I don't really know I don't talk to any of them that much one of my cousins was super supportive and she messaged me and stuff and like said she loves me and everything like that and then unfortunately my other grandma passed away during COVID so we had to have a zoom funeral memorial for her and I did notice like my one uncle used my correct name and pronouns in the zoom meeting and when he had me like speak about my grandma and stuff like that so that was really cool the rest of the family I don't really know because it was a, like a group meeting and no one else talked or anything but it has been cool to see that some of my like super Christian whatever family members have been really accepting from the beginning but I guess yeah the main point of this video and like this whole series is just like mind fuck things about being trans that you might not think about and like I remember when my grandma asked me the first time who I, I, like who she was talking to on the phone I just remember being like, like it's just oh, I didn't expect that. But then I did remember my voice dropped, and she probably had my dead name in the, in her phone. So like she was just so confused who she was talking to, and it just like still sticks with me to this day, even though that was months ago. Uh, yeah, I think that's it for this video. I want to keep these all short and sweet, and every topic is gonna be like a different thing. I'm gonna do one on dating and one on work environment, one on friends, one on friends you might have lost, stuff like that. So if you like the series, please subscribe. You can find me on Instagram and Twitter at the Bendy Boo. I just changed my Insta or my Twitter to first trans Jesus actually. 
think it's funny my friends are doing a weird Jesus thing, but whatever. Uh, at the Bendy Boo on Instagram is where I post lots of fun stuff and like transitional stuff, voice updates and everything. And yeah, I can't thank you enough for watching this. Let me know what other topics you want me to talk about down below. I will pretty much talk about anything on here. I'm really open and I just want like to help somebody. If I help one person with this video, that was worth it to me. So if there's topics down below, you want me to talk about like different awkward trans stuff like this is the time to ask because I will do a video on all of that stuff and yeah have a good night morning evening afternoon whatever uh, check out my merch store at shop te on Instagram I will put a link in the description as well for my Etsy store and thank you have a good night peace